Look at the morning mist. We had some lovely sunny days in November. And then some days, the mountains and the sea just disappear and nothing exists beyond our village. Hello, welcome to my November vlog. So it's a bit of a challenge filming in this window because one side of my face is completely overexposed and the other side is dark. <laughs> but um, I've decided not to use artificial lighting. So you love, just have to put up with it, sorry. I hope you've been well. I've had a lovely November. So I've realized one thing lately and that is that I live much more closely to nature and the, the cycles of nature than I used to. I was, I, I'm somebody who's always been very aware of like the cycles of the moon and the change of the seasons. But when you live in a city or in a town, all this is more theoretical. I mean, you put on a warmer jacket in the winter and turn on the heating, but that's it. Whereas here, it's just more, much more pronounced. There's the heat in the summer, 30, 35 degrees, and the window's always open. And then in the winter, the entire course of the day changes because everybody here in this village heats by wood fire, like my wood oven, which means in the winter I get up, it's freezing cold in the morning. And the first thing I do before tea, before anything else is lay the fire and make a fire. And then because I have a small house, if I open all the, all the doors, the entire house will be roasting from that one oven. But it requires maintenance and attention throughout the day, which also changes my work day. I can't do two hour laser focus sessions because I need to keep an eye on the on the fire and keep getting up and putting in more wood and, and the briquettes or whatever and, and maintain that fire. During the summer, the main noise you hear in the village is very quiet here normally, but you hear noise sometimes for hours and hours of those electric saws that, that keep going that cut when people are cutting the wood. And that's obviously how I get my wood as well. It's all very local and very sustainable. We all own a bit of forest. Everybody here does in the in the area. But this village has been here for hundreds of years. And the forest is still as it's, it's still there. We never take more wood than can grow back. So I really like the fact that this is so local and sustainable. <laughs> I used every sunny day to either go into town or take walks. November. You can't possibly mean to blossom now, you silly flower. Oh, it's cold. <laughs> it's about 14 degrees in here right now. Just close the window. house is well insulated but if I leave the heating off overnight it gets really cold <laughs> oh this calls for tea driving here, it's, I, I'm not progressing very fast because it's so bloody beautiful here. Slovenia in autumn is incredible. And if you ever get the chance to visit, I would highly recommend that you do. So 
this entire museum is built on the remains of a Roman house that I'm going to presume they found when they started digging the foundations. Isn't that wild? And this is part of the old wall. Amazing architecture, but there's also a lot of green right in the center, or yellow as it were. Ljubljana by night, highly recommended. Eventually it was time to go to the concert hall. Obviously I couldn't film the performance, so I took some video before and some pictures afterwards. It was incredible. Oh my god, snow! There's snow on the mountains. First snow this winter. actually done it. It's blossoming. Look at this. I like you. Little rebel. So I'm just taking a short turn through the village. Much to the annoyance of the village dogs. <laughs> I'm not supposed to be here. Yeah, yeah. All right, Zoya. All right. Good girl. And here, that's the viewing platform of the village that I showed you in an earlier video when I just moved in last year. And the good thing about being in my house is that my view is actually better than the view from the official viewing platform of the village because I'm higher up and I can see all the way to the sea, as you know. I'm going back home because it's cold. It's freezing cold. Yeah. 
you like this vlog, like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. Visit my website wildspiritscoaching.com if you'd like to learn some more. Have a lovely December. Much love to you. Bye bye.